They say oil built empires, uranium built bombs, but thorium, thorium could have built freedom. It's the cleanest, safest, most powerful nuclear fuel mankind ever discovered. One ton of thorium can power an entire city with zero meltdowns, zero carbon, and zero dependency on oil cartels. And guess what? India holds over 30% of the world's thorium reserves. A gift buried in the sands of Kerala's coast, enough to power this nation for a thousand years. Yet, it lies in the dark, ignored, forgotten, locked away behind bureaucracy, corruption, and global politics. Because thorium threatens the balance of power, it threatens uranium lobbies, it threatens Western energy dominance, it threatens oil billionaires and nuclear cartels that profit from scarcity. not abundance in the 1960s india dreamed of a three stage nuclear program uranium to plutonium and finally to thorium reactors dr homi bhaba saw it coming he wanted india to become energy sovereign then his plane exploded in 1966 coincidence or consequence you decide decades later while china and the us played god with fossil fuel politics India's thorium dream was buried under red tape, sanctions, and silence. Even today, our beaches shimmer with radioactive monazite sand, but we export it for peanuts while importing overpriced uranium. Why? Because dependency pays. Independence doesn't. Thorium could have made India the energy superpower of the 21st century. Instead, we became the largest market for oil. This isn't science. This is suppression. a quiet war for control of the atom where the strongest weapon is ignorance thorium was never just an element it was a revolution silenced before ignition and until india wakes up to it we'll keep begging for oil while sitting on the fire of the gods thorium the power they don't want india to use